Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. It is 2017 and this is going to be the first makeup tutorial for 2017. Before I continue, just know that I am apologizing in advance for the way I sound and I've just been sick. I was sick at the end of November and I had like a lingering like dry cough and I finally went to the doctors last weekend. I was given more antibiotics and for whatever reason, I got sick again. So I'm still trying to get over it and over all this like it's 2017, it's a brand new year and I don't want to be sick. So today I am creating this just peachy look for you using the peach palette from Too Faced. This is absolutely gorgeous. I was so excited to get my hands on it finally. Anyways, I'm not gonna chat anymore and let's just get right into the tutorial. So for today's look, I'm going to be using this Too Faced Peach Palette. So I'm going to take the shade Georgia and I'm going to place it all over the lid. Or the crease area, I'm sorry. This is creating an even base for whatever color I use next. So I'm going to use my same blending brush and I'm going to pick a puree. And I'll we'll place that in the crease. Then I'm going to take Summer Yum with a flat top brush and I'm going to just darken the crease area with that. I'm literally letting my eye crease just fold and putting that brush right into there. I'm just going to take my blending brush and blend that out a bit. Now for the color that I've been wanting to use, the one color that stuck out to me the moment I saw this palette and it's just so beautiful. It reminds me actually of um, Lauren Rauch's blush and I have a blush that I'm currently using which is a peach pink blush from, um, let's see, this is Show Me Your Cheeks Blush Elizabeth Mott and I got this in Ipsy one time and I love this blush. Like you guys can see, I've hit pan. The next icon I'm going to be using from this palette reminds me of this, which also reminds me of the NARS Orgasm blush, which is right here. So Just Peachy just looks so Just Peachy. So I'm picking it up on a flat shader brush and just going to pop it on. Do you see how beautiful that is? And I'm going to take this shade here, that one's called White Peach, and I'm just going to pop that on my brow bone. So apparently my lighting was off, so sorry about that guys. But now I'm going to take the color Cobbler, with my same flat shader brush, and I'm going to line that right under my lower lash line. And this is a little extras that I do, so you don't have to do all of this, but it's just extras. And I'm going to take this shade here called Luscious, and I'm going to pop that right on the inner portion of the eye. And I want to add just a bit more sparkle, so I'm going to take Bellini and pop that in the center of the lid. It's a very similar color to Just Peachy, so um, you're not going to see like a dramatic difference, but it's beautiful. Now I'm just going to pop on my liner. And 
now we're going to curl the lashes and do mascara. So now I'm just going to finish, finish. I'm just going to finish the rest of my face. This is the Urban Decay Concealer. I'm just going to take a little bit of my setting powder and dab that on to it. So while that's doing its thing, I'm going to go ahead and line my lips. This here is a lip liner from Bella Pierre Cosmetics. It's a gel lip liner in the color Nude number 2. Today I'm going to use this Selena um, lipstick in the color Amor Forbido, if that's how you say it. I'm not Spanish, so <laughs> trying to learn. So now I'm just going to blush this away. <laughs> brush this away. I'm going to apply mascara to my lower lash line. this is a completed look and it's a beautiful look that you can wear to work you can wear to um, whatever daily activities you have it's not like overly done it's not over dramatic so like I was saying in the tutorial I love all the beautiful creative makeup that many of these artists and youtubers youtubers do but sometimes I feel like it's not something you can wear every day or to like work or school or church or whatever it's like full-on glam which there's nothing wrong with full-on glam because I love a full glam but it's a lot of work, it's time consuming, and if you're literally just like learning or getting more into makeup, it's it's hard to like, kind of hard to just be perfect at it. Like it takes time, it takes skills, it takes practice for you to get to the level that you want to be. So I just want to create looks that you can use for every single day. So guys, thanks again so much for watching. Don't forget to follow me on social media. I'm going to link everything below. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I'd love to have you here on my channel. And if you are subscribed, don't forget to click on the little bell so you're notified every time that I do post a video. So again, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you later. Bye!